Hey everyone, this is James. I hope you guys are having a good one. In this video, we're gonna jump into some behind the scenes uh, images and video footage from last night's speech session. If you follow me on social media, either on Instagram or on Facebook, you've probably already seen a little clip of this. But like I said, in this video, we'll go into a more uh, deeper dive into what was going on and what was going through my head because when I got down there, I almost freaked out. And I'll explain why <laughs> in just a second. So let's go ahead and jump on in here. So when we got down to Ponce Inlet, again, one of my favorite uh, places to shoot at, the place was jam-packed. I mean, jam-packed. I couldn't even park. I had to park along the side. It was nuts. So I'm already thinking, oh my gosh, there's going to be 15,000 people everywhere. Uh, again, it's not normally like this, but okay. it's what it was last night. But I, I tried to reassure the family. Uh, and I think now that they've seen, seen some of the images, they're okay with it. But I just reassured them, even though it's craziness down here, we're going to work around it. We're going to get through it. It's going to be okay. So what you're seeing right now on the screen is basically the reflection shot that I like to do with families. When the weather is great, when the sun's out, it creates that beautiful reflection that you're seeing right in front of them there on this particular video. And that's one of the first shots that I like to grab because I like to do that one first get that one out of the way while the sun is you know it's 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 out it's nice but it's not you know blaring in our face and then as the sun drops you know we work around different areas of the beach you know after that so you can see the reflection shot going on here um, we've got 5,000 people around them this one's not too bad it got really crazy when i did the kids and the parents i mean there were just kids running back and forth behind them around them and i'm just like oh this is going to be an editing nightmare <laughs> but like i said i'll jump into photoshop and let you see the before and after and what i had to work with uh, there let me go ahead and and uh, get another clip on the screen this is the parents i wanted to isolate them because if honestly if, if if you think about it it's probably been a while since you guys as parents have had just pictures of you guys i know it's been a while for my wife and i and so this is one of the special things that I like to do is just once I've got pictures of the group of group shots of the kids at some point and actually several points or several times, I should say, during the session, I try to grab the parents and just get them by themselves and do a shot here, do a shot elsewhere on the beach and, and just have some fun. So that's what I'm doing here. And you can see all of the people around them. <laughs> it was just absolute nuts. And you can see the kids right here. They're running back and forth and... Uh, I don't know if the audio is high enough on this clip, but, uh, but I'm just like, uh, as, I'm, as I'm shooting, <laughs> just thinking this is going to be a, just a nightmare to edit. But we had a good time. We had fun. And uh, this is what this reflection shot looks like. I mean, you can clearly see it uh, here, uh, you know, uh, right there at their feet here. Let me, let me put another one up on the screen here. Okay. This is their boys. Once, you know, this actually the order I did is we did, we did, uh, the family as a whole and then we did the boys and then I said grandma was there so I asked her um, you know if it would be okay if, if she watched them or they stayed with them and let me grab the parents so that will, that's what's going on here but you can see I mean look at all the kids right behind them um, I'm kind of moving around I'm trying to get the shot right because I'm trying to minimize the amount of work I'm gonna have to do uh, at the end you know to get their shot the way I want it and get the look the way I want it but this I just wanted to show you guys and give you a recap of what's going through my head and what I am seeing as I'm taking their beach photos. And again, you guys have heard me say this before. This is something to ask your beach photographer. If you, if you get down there, there's people around you, there's people behind you. You know, will they take the extra time to edit those pictures out or the people out, those objects out, things like that behind them? Uh, do they do that? Does, is it an additional cost? You know what what kind of goes what goes in um you know to the cost of you know of, of doing this so uh my my opinion and where i stand on that is you know i'm there to get the best shots for you that i can sometimes when we get to the beach i can't control who's at the beach i can't control what's going on at the beach and it's not fair to me to walk up to these people behind them and say hey can you guys get out of the way while i take some pictures and of course i wouldn't say it like that but you know, it wouldn't even be fair to say, hey, can you guys just step out for two or three minutes? Let me take some shots. And I mean, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to work around who's there. 
I'm gonna work with the family that I'm with, we're gonna get some great shots, and if I have to do that extra step of editing, then I will. So anyway, just wanted to show you a couple clips of this. Let's jump into Photoshop here, and I'll show you some um, before and after images. I just picked two or, I think I've just shown you two here. Um, because you know these guys are kind of at the end of my queue here. I've still got some other families I've got to finish, but I did want to take some time and just show you okay. the absolute craziness <laughs> that goes on. And again, just so you guys know, if you're watching this and you're like, oh my gosh, I've heard this guy talk about Ponsonlet before. It's not always like this, I, I promise you. Usually when, when I get down there, it's there's maybe six, seven, eight cars maybe, if even that, in the parking lot. So this was just an unusual time. It had been raining all week here in Daytona Beach. So this was a beautiful day today, and I think everybody just, of course, it's a Sunday, and everybody just said, let's go. So anyway, that's what's, that's what's going on here. Just wanted to just mention that. So let's jump into Photoshop, and I'll uh, show you some before and after images here. So this is the raw image that you're seeing, making sure you're seeing it. Yep, you're seeing it of the uh, the family here um, as we're doing the reflection shot I'm just kind of shooting away and I'll take a, you know a handful of those best shots and obviously I'm looking for the ones that are uh, easiest to work with obviously I'm looking at them and I'm making sure everybody's looking at me or if I can get the most amount of people looking at me as I can and then uh, also looking at what's behind them so as you can see I've got some I've got people here I've got uh, uh, come on. I've got this lady here. I've got a fishing pole here. And um, so that's what, you know, I, I was working with. So uh, the images or the image that I edited on this one looks like this. And I've got to go back. Let me just take me off the screen here. I've got to go back and I want to fix up some of this. I'm not really liking the way this looks here. Um, but I, I, you know, I think it turned out beautiful. Again, this is the before. Got people over here, this lady, and then this is the after. And again, you can see I'm also taking into account their reflection here and making sure that is gone as well. When I did just the parents themselves, uh, if you remember from the video, there were tons of kids, as you're looking at the image that were to the left, and they were going in and out, in and out, in and out. So I was kind of moving around and, and moving around and, and making sure I, I got where it was the min minimal amount of kids possible. <laughs> you know, I waited to that little guy on the right side of the screen was, you know, was off the screen a little bit. And uh, you know, then just kind of started snapping away. So again, this is the before image, raw image straight out of the camera. And then this is the after image that they will see. Again, cleaning up some of the reflections cleaning up this guy over here, taking him all out. And again, that's the before and the after image of that. So, make sure I got my buttons right here. All right, so now I'm back. <laughs> but anyway, I just wanted to show you guys just a real uh, quick recap of the footage of some raw images inside Photoshop and then what it looks like afterwards. And I love doing this. You guys have heard me talk about this and say this you know, many, many times. I'll probably keep doing it. I love doing this. I love sharing it with you guys. And I love letting you see what goes on with me at the beach and all the fun I have. And, this, and it's not just beach sessions. It's when I'm filming weddings, when I'm photographing weddings, when I'm working with families for their portraits, you know, if we're at a park or the gardens. Um, lots of videos that I've done on that, and I'll continue to make more. But just love to share this, love to share behind the scenes, love to work with families. Uh, I'm a family guy myself. That's To me, that's one of the most important things uh, that you can do is make these memories with your family and, and, and have, have great times and make great memories. And I'm all about that. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And um, yeah, any comments, questions, let me know. <laughs> And I will catch you guys on the next video or live stream or upload that I post. All right, you guys have a good one. I'll catch you on the next, next video.